Hey guys, shooting for fun here. Hey, uh, we're doing one here today we haven't done in a while, and uh, this is our uh, Henry rifle. I'm gonna appear to see if you can see it there. It's a little 22, and uh, it's a lever action. These are great little guns here. They shoot great, they're accurate. Um, what we've got here is we've got us a speed loader so we don't have to sit there and crank these puppies in one at a time. And the way this works is we'll take our little uh, rod out here, our feet, feet tube there, and you just take it and boom, loads all 15 at once. That was pretty quick, wasn't it? Makes it nice where we didn't have to sit there and poke them in one at a time. All right, we got our target a little farther out there on our second light there, so we're gonna see how she does here. Hopefully the uh, shot won't hit the camera there. We'll bring our target in and see how we did there. We haven't got this one in a while. Alrighty. Give us a look there. See that? Not too bad there for the first time. We even got one in the center there. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can run that back out again. So the camera up here for a little different angle here, see how that works. We have a hard time here with my Camera trying to get the angles right there. The camera wants to keep falling down. All right, here we go. We'll pull our feed tube out. We just turn our little dial here to the next spot. Boom! All 15 loaded. Saves a ton of time at the range loading with that speed loader. All right, now these little Henry rifles, they come in a couple of different kinds. This one, if you can see on the top here, it's got the octagon barrel. Um, they do make the same, the same 22, but it's got the round barrel. Um, they do make them in the golden boy with the golden uh, pieces and the gold trigger and stuff. Uh, they do make the bigger loops that you can buy, the, the rounded style loops that you can buy. Um, this one I put the little leather wrap on there, and of course we've done our custom little butt stock on there. But these are just awesome little guns. You can see I'm just holding the gun and shooting. You know, there's no scope or anything on there. Just using the, uh, the sights that are on it, and it, it's pretty accurate little gun there. 
said, I'm no sharpshooter by any means there, so let's give it another try here and see how she does. There we go. Alright. Let's bring our target in and see if we did any good there. Right. You can see there we done. Pretty good job there. It's a second light, which is probably, I don't know, 50 feet out, I guess. Um, got a couple of long, longer ones out here, but for me just holding and shooting, and I did shoot kind of fast there. Like I said, that's just me with my eyeballing it there. I'm gonna take our little shoes here. These things, my uh, bottom got cracked there and I had to kind of tape that up. But, um, these things are awesome. They hold uh, 15 rounds in each tube and there's like eight tubes there. So you get quite a few shots. Like I said, it saves a ton of time having to, to reload rather than having to sit there and drop each one in the magazine separately. And these things are just a fun little gun to shoot. It's like the old western guns, you know. And like I said, you got that kind of accuracy from 50 feet out from me just holding it. You know, imagine what you could do with this thing if you had a scope, you know. And uh, it's got the little rail here on top. You can mount your scope rings and stuff and put your scope on there. Um, I do like the nice uh, walnut stock that's on there, really pretty stock. Uh, gold bead on the front sight there, nice. And uh, like I said, I've shot this thing and, you know, you can see it just went through about 30 rounds there, 45 rounds, and, you know, never had a misfire, it's never jammed. I mean, these are just excellent little guns. Um, I know people that have had these and they go squirrel hunting and stuff with them, <laughs> you know. Alright, we're going to do some headshots now, see how we do. Try to get my gun facing downrange, but the camera keeps wanting to turn on me. All right. If you notice, I'm not shooting, you know, real slow. I'm doing it pretty quick. There we go. 15 shots there. I always like 
back there a couple of times there, make sure she's out. Like I said, we're shooting kind of fast there. We're not really. Taking some hard aim there and stuff. Like I said, if we'd have had a scope or something, but we look at it. I think we didn't do too bad there. From that distance there, we did put a herd on them. Like I said, from that distance, I can't see the little dots on there from that distance. So I'm just kind of guessing, you know, in the general area there, but oh no, not too bad there. All right, folks. Uh, these guns, they range anywhere between three, four hundred dollars. Um, they do come in a 357. You can get these handier rifles in the 357. You can get them in a 4570. You can get them in a 44. Um, they're just, they're just excellent little guns. You know, if you're into the Western style kind of guns. You know, these, these are a nice little gun there. All right, guys. We're shooting for fun, and thanks for watching.